Okay, so let's solve this problem. So the second term in the arithmetic sequence is 24 and the fifth term is 3. Then find the first term and the common difference. So using this formula, that's a sub n equals a sub m plus d times n minus m. So this a sub n, that's the last term. And a sub m, that's any terms in the sequence except the last term. And d, that's the common difference. So from the given, if we let this second term as a sub m, so a sub m, the second term, so that's a sub 2. Then equals, since the value of second term is 24, so a sub m is 24. Then if we let this fifth term as the last term or a sub n, so since fifth term, so that's a sub 5 and the value that's positive 3. So to solve now for this common difference using this formula, so just substitute these values. So we have this a sub n and a sub n is equal to 3. Then equals a sub m a sub m that's 24 then plus d that's the common difference this one is the unknown then times n since a sub n equals a sub 5 so n is equal to 5 then minus a sub m equals a sub 2 so m equals 2 so minus 2 then simplify, so transpose this positive 24, so we have 3 minus 24 equals D times 5 minus 2, this one is 3. Then this 3 minus 24, this one is negative 21 equals uh, 3D. Then divide both sides by positive 3 to solve for D. So this negative 21 divided by 3, that's negative 7. So negative 7 is the common difference. Then to solve for this first term, since we have this second term, so to solve for first term, that's a sub 1 equals the second term minus the common difference. Since the second term, is 24 so we have this 24 minus the common difference that's negative 7 so we have now 24 the negative and negative that becomes positive so a sub 1 now is equal to 24 plus 7 that's 31 so therefore Positive 31 is the first term in the arithmetic sequence.